Now that's a toad walleye. <laughs> that's probably one of the biggest walleyes I've ever caught. In fact, this one's going to go on my wall. Let me put it in the live well, and then I'll tell you exactly how we caught it. Wow, what a toad. Here's what we're trying to accomplish. You know, the reef runner is a great crankbait. We can get this down to about 28 feet, but I'd have to let it back 200 feet to accomplish that. Using a tadpole diver, I can take this same crankbait and get it down 28 feet with half as much line out. And here's how we do it. We start out by just zeroing out our line counter and letting our reef runner back about 20 feet to 30 feet. And in this instance, I'm going to go ahead and go let out 30 feet. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my little number two tadpole that I've got rigged up here. I'm going to grab my fishing line and I'm just going to make some curly cues and I'm going to put my release, the front release, the OR19, right onto the line. And then the second release in the back, the red one, the OR16, I'm going to put it onto the line. So what's happening now is the tadpole is attached in line. All right. So when I take this tadpole and drop it in the water, it's actually going to start diving and pulling the crankbait down. So what I'll do is I'll zero up my counter again now, and I can let out additional line as much as I need to get the tadpole to the depth that I want. And right now, what seems to be working the best for us, 30 foot lead, and then behind that, we're letting out 60 to 90 foot additional lead. And that's what's getting us to the depth that we're trying to, to catch these fish. All right. So I got my crankbait out. I got a tadpole diver in line to help make it go deeper. Now all I need to do is put my OR12 side planer board on to get the whole shooting match out to the side. And the beauty of this, this one's set up here with a tattle flag as well. The beauty of it is the tadpole doesn't pull so hard that the, that the tattle flag systems don't work. They work beautiful. So all I need to do is let this out to the side. And what I've ended up with here is I've got a reef runner running 28 feet, but I've only got half as much line out as you would normally have to let out in order to get that crankbait to run that deep. All right, put that there. Now that's what I'm talking about. That is a Bay of Quinte walleye, and we caught it using a tadpole diver in combination with a reef runner crankbait. You know, reef runners are great crankbaits, and they dive pretty deep, but in order to get it to dive to the depth we wanted it, 28 feet, we had to let them back 200 feet. Put the tadpole in line, and all of a sudden now we've got a total lead length of less than 100 feet in order to be able to catch big fish like this. What a great deal. Holy mackerel. That, that's one of the biggest walleyes I've ever caught. <laughs> what a toad.